right, love my beautiful for the sign of cancer. This is gonna be your reading. Uh, let's go ahead and get your message for my cancers. Let's see what is the message for my cancers. Meditate and contemplate is the new moon in Pisces. We start with Pisces energy in this reading, my lovely. Uh, let's go ahead and get... Um, Let's see what the Romans Oracle Angels want to tell us for this reading. Let's see. Okay, the calling of your soul. May your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help you to bring you guys together. This is your soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. And children, your love life can be affected and being affected by children's my cancer. My cancer, they 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 are a sign that they really like children. So I'm really surprised um, that your relationship is being affected by children. So let's see. Let's see what else the uh, the cards want to tell us for this reading. Let's see what else is coming out. Look. The Two of Cups, that's the energy of love from the Two of Cups. We just can tell already the energy for this reading. It's a really nice energy. Oh, you start wonderful, my Cancers. Your reading is start. What a way to start a reading. You start with the energy of Ten of Pentacles. It is a person that I want to make long-term plans with you. And on the top of that, you have the Two of, um, of Wands. The Eleven Eleven card. The Five of Pentacles. Ooh, a passionate relationship. Oof, the magician manifesting, manifesting things in your life. Don't know what to do in this one. Okay, my beautiful cancer. This is beautiful. And let's go ahead and get started with the, with the first two cards. It is a person that is making long-term plans with you. This person sees you as their, as you are their soulmate. And they want to make long-term plans with you. They see you as a person that they want to spend all their life with you. They really like you. They really want you in their life. And they are planning. They are thinking, how can I make this relationship happen? How can I express to this person how I feel about this person? They maybe already talked to you about this, but they see you as their soulmate. They see you. You have two cards of soulmates here in this reading. And on the top of that, you have the 1111. That is the card of the soulmate. It is a beautiful relationship. It is a beautiful energy on the soulmate card. And it seems like a, this um, person is like a hot and cold. I don't know why the relationship it had that feeling that it's like a hot and cold relationship. That you guys suddenly you are doing good and then you start doing not so good. And it's just this hot and cold energy with this person. And I don't understand why. Because they truly see you as their soulmate. They truly want to make long-term plans. I don't know if they are scared maybe to move forward the relationship because of a uh, situation in the past. That the relationship didn't went that well. They feel like they couldn't have, um, keep their balance. They help that person a lot and it wasn't reciprocate because the thing with the six of pentacles, do you see the six of pentacles? He's helping these people. He's well-dressed. He's giving, 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 and he's not getting anything in return. So he may was in a relation or he may or she may, she may was or he may was in a relationship where he was just giving, 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 giving. And not getting anything in return. He just was giving and giving and giving. And, and that's why he just like kind of thinking about, okay, that I do really want to move forward this relationship. It's like a, this feeling of trap. Or trap. Uh, uh, this one can be you because the energy can be for you too. It's like uh, this person is trapped. 
it doesn't feel like a, I, I just don't know if I want to move forward with a relationship. I cannot see, yes, I have all these feelings with this person. I see it as a, my soulmate. I see it as a long-term person that I want to share my life with you. But I cannot see... I cannot see the clear future, so I'm trying to plan to see what is going to happen with the relationship on the future, but I cannot see my way in front of me. I cannot see how can we just progress this relationship. For you, it's going to be, for all of you, it's going to be different reasons, but I see the energy for some of you that this is a long distance relationship for some of you. And uh, that's what these people is trying to plan, that they are trying to, how can I move this relationship forward? Or, or they see that your difference between each other is too much for them to handle. And that's why oh, it can be affected by children too. It has something to do with children. Maybe that person doesn't have no children and they don't want anything to do with your children. Or you don't want to you don't want anything to do with his children. Um, take it as a resting name. Okay, it's not going to be for everybody. It's not going to be exactly the reason it's going to be the children. Maybe they adore the children and, you know. And it's a really passionate relationship. And you manifested this relationship in your life. And now it's just hot and cold, hot and cold. What is going on? You are like, what is going on with this man? You cannot, you cannot figure it out. You cannot fully figure it out, figure it out this relationship. Um... Okay, let's see what else what else we have in here. And it is for the sign of cancer. And it is for the sign of cancer. Yes, 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 yes. They see you as a long term. But they are also, they are also like dealing with something. They are, they are dealing with the situation, with uh, things. I don't know. They are thinking. They are thinking at night about you. They think about you all the time. Um, they don't know what to do. It's just an energy of planning, planning, planning. And when they're going to manifest things. And they want you only for themselves. That's the thing. They are just so selfish about you that they want you only for themselves. But they they just keep this hot and cold energy. Uh, this person has more choices. This person has more choices. Um, it's taking them a while to figure it out what they want. They have so many choices, and it doesn't have to be only choices for love. It can be also choices for job, choices for profession, choices for things to do. They have so many choices. They are now a little bit confused, and they don't know what to do. They are trying to choose. They tend to choose you. They know that you are their soulmate, but they are having a hard time. Let it go, the things from the past, and choose you. They do want it. They feel like they have way too many burdens. Or you feel like this relationship is like really burning you. It's like way too many burdens for you, way too much weight for you. And you just want to just move the situation forward. You just want to move the situation forward, but things is now moving forward. But it's giving you the energy of um, celebration. The things are going to move forward. Things are going to be different. Yeah, and the magician is coming. You are going to manifest what you want in your relationship. Keep your prayers, your affirmations, and your visualizations in what you really want. Because you are the one that is going to bring the, the, the result. You are the one that is going to bring what you want to your life. It's going to be all up to you. You have the energy of the magician. The magician, you are the magician in your life you are the one that manifesting this in your life and this relationship is a blessing for god from you what is coming when he finally with person finally decide to come forward you're just gonna see this as a blessing from from god it's gonna see like a finally things are moving forward finally things are just going and it's gonna be so so good for you it's gonna be like a little celebration for you Finally, things are moving forward. Finally, things are where, where I want them to be. Uh, my cancer, let's see. What else What else can we see in this reading? What else? 
what else can we see in this relationship what else this person is gonna do they they are coming to offer you a pentacle they will not be able to hold it anymore they are they are coming to offer you a pentacle uh they will be able to finally uh, clear their mind and decide for something um let's see where it comes yeah, this person feel like they need time. It is just the clock. Need time, tapes time, and cycles, time to heal, progress. So they just need time. It's like, a, oh, this, this, they feel like a, this relationship is going too fast and they just need time to, to, to process, to plan, to process, to do things, to watching and looking uh watching and looking gaslighting perception and focusing they are they are watching you they they keep these things they keep their your pictures they have your pictures they look at your pictures they look at the internet they look at your facebook post they are watching though yeah they they are they they look at you they know talk about frustrated in the relationship lack of confidence self-sabotage fear ego issues okay jealousies yeah it's feel like a, this person is not giving you enough they are giving you they are they are bread crumbing you it's like bread crumbs uh they are not giving you enough they they have all these feelings for you but they are just uh, giving you bread crumbs and it's up to you if you want to take it or not in, in the end my cancers it's your decision what you want to do your decision you just wait for them to like finally decide what they want to do or you just move on you just move on with someone else you move on because god is gonna bless you anyway you have the page of pentacles here it's a blessing that is coming from god someone is gonna come and offer you a pentacle but it's, it's gonna be your choice if you just decide to take this person or not you sh you just have to decide what you want okay okay and it, it came the card oneness is your true nature that was the message from the universe oneness is your true nature for my cancers okay uh okay this is the time that i answered three of your questions my lovely this is the time that i answered three of your questions so focus your energy on the cards focus your energy in what you want to ask focus your energy on the questions and I will put three cards. You decide if you want one, two, or three questions. And then I will turn the card and I will tell you it's a yes or no questions, okay? So prepare your question. Here comes the cards. One, two, and three. So focus, which one do you want? Which one do you choose? Ask your question, focus in your question, okay? You are welcome to stop the video if you want. Card number one. It is a yes. It is a seven of pentacles. Yes. It is a yes. It's a nine of cup. And it is a yes. My beautiful cancers. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, my cancers. I love you guys so much. You guys take care. Bye-bye.